guys, it is Clissa and welcome back or welcome to my channel if you're new here today. We are going to be doing a productive fall night routine. I just want to kind of relax and decompress tonight so I decided I'm going to do some like extra little like self-care stuff that I wouldn't normally do on a nightly basis but I'm going to take you through what a gist of a productive college night in my life looks like it's not very exciting we're gonna start with like tidying up and then we'll just see where the night takes us it's only five right now but i have a lot of stuff that i want to do so that's why i'm starting to film right now so before we get into this video please do not forget to like comment and subscribe if you enjoy leave me something down below because i respond to every single one and i just love talking and connecting with you guys my goal is to hit thousand subscribers by the end of the year so please help make that dream possible for me also don't forget to follow me on instagram at Clissa coleman for some fun little pictures. All right, that is enough blabbering. We're just gonna get on with doing some little chores and yeah. So my mom actually just got this Dyson today. She got it refurbished off of eBay because it's way cheaper that way. So I'm going to vacuum my room and test this out. So this is one of the cordless ones and I'm just gonna preface this that we just carpet cleaned maybe two months ago. Like we carpet cleaned in the summer and we don't wear shoes on the carpet. So this should be fairly clean, but we already did our stairs earlier and it was bad. So I'm gonna go through and do this and I wanna see how dirty it is. The canister's empty right now. So we're gonna see how dirty it is. I'm scared because like it sucks up all this dirt that you had no idea was there. It's kind of disgusting, but also really cool. So time lapse. So I am done. Super easy, super nice to like, this isn't a review, I don't know what I'm saying. I already knew that I was going to like it, but like I said, we carpet cleaned like two months ago and we don't wear shoes in the house. Do you see that? Shake it up a little. Can you see all that? It's absolutely disgusting. And so much hair, I'm shedding, like I think I'm losing my hair because it's falling out like crazy, but look at all the dirt. The, the hair's not what bothers me, it's the dirt that bothers me. And then like a bunch of my hair is trapped in the head, so I'm gonna have to cut that out. But like, it just, I mean, that's bad. Like I, just, I told you guys, I tried to just throw my hair away in the trash can, but it just like, it falls out like crazy. But anyway, wow. Definitely if you don't have enough money to buy a Dyson brand new because we weren't going to spend that much money on a vacuum, look at their eBay and they have refurbished ones. So it's definitely a cheap alternative. I think she only paid well, only. I think she paid $300 for this one, which is still a lot, but considering the new price, a nice difference. Go. 
Okay guys, well, um, I just spilled my water all over the counter, but um, I am trying to complete the stuff on my to-do list. I need to do some homework. I'm filming my video currently. I'll start editing my video later. I need to pick out an outfit for work and I need to make lunch for work. So today was actually kind of really busy. I had stats at nine on campus. Um, and for those of you who don't know me, I'm actually a sophomore in college and I am getting my BA in psychology. So let me know if any of you guys are college students and what you're studying. Three term classes that are starting are all online, so that'll be fine. But I just got a job and for those of you who don't know, I've been on the struggle bus looking for a job for a while um, because my last job is no longer having stuff going on. I worked at an auditorium and so that isn't really a thing anymore. The attire is like casual business and I had no casual business clothes. We were going to go to a thrift store, but they're closed on Monday, so I was like, so we just went to our local mall and I got a pair of pants that I wanted and then I got, I think one blouse and then we went into Bath and Body and I wanted to show you guys these. So I got two candles. I got this toasted coconut mocha. And then I also got this raspberry mimosa. And they literally smell so amazing. So this is like perfect because I love coconut. And this raspberry mimosa, I love raspberries. But wow, it just smells like fresh fruit, I guess, with like, it smells like lemon a little bit. They literally smell so good. So I think I'm going to light the toasted coconut mocha one tonight because it's a little more like, in this fall vibe that I'm going for rather than the raspberry mimosa, which kind of just smells like a summer scent, which is totally fine. So definitely think I'm gonna light this in a little bit. I think that's about it. So right now I'm going to log onto my computer and see if there's any homework that I need to do and maybe get ahead on some stuff since I don't really have my free days anymore and that's when I would do my homework. Okay guys, so dinner has been consumed at a rapid pace because I cannot control myself. But it was really yummy and I'm freezing now. So I decided I'm going to take a shower because I need to wash my hair. But now I think I'm gonna take a bath because we also got an order from Lush and today. But I'm going to light up this new candle now. And then I think I'm gonna light my other one that's all the way over there. And then we're just gonna get some clean hair and take a bath afterwards. I, it's really hard for me to wash my hair in the bath. So I like to do a shower bath. So I'll take a shower and then after that side, so put the bath on. Also, look at my new phone case. Isn't it so cute? Um, if you guys are OGs, then you know I've had that big clunky OtterBox for like a year now. But I finally switched over to a cute case for the first time, which is really cute. This little skeleton's doing yoga. I didn't get it for Halloween, but it like works for Halloween, but I thought this is just like cute all year round. And then I just got a glass screen protector and I'm terrified of dropping it because I dropped my outer box all the time and oh my God, I really need to clean this mirror. That helped a little bit, but we're going to start our shower and get a little cozy.
Okay, so I don't really know how well you can hear me, but before I got in the shower, I wanted to show you the bath bomb order that we got in today. So I got this cute little pumpkin one for Halloween, obviously, which is why I'm using it tonight. Then I got a peach. How cute. I got a peach and it looks like it has glitter in it and it smells really yummy. Then these aren't mine, but these are Jenna's. She got a little monster guy for Halloween as well. And then she also got a little hippopotamus. <laughs> So it's been a minute since I last updated this video, but um, I dyed my eyebrows. I'm sure you can tell. Um, I started dyeing my eyebrows a few months ago and I love it so much. Um, if you go back to my like first couple videos I made, it was like, it's a big difference. And I know these look way too dark right now, but in like four days, it'll be like perfect color for me but like I usually don't put a lot of makeup on so like at least having the eyebrows on makes me feel like I kind of got ready excuse me um I'm trying to pick out what top I want to wear to work tomorrow oh, I'm not really sure but I'll probably narrow it down later I don't know why wow with the lights on my eyebrows look way too dark but it's fine. I use the Ardell brow tint or whatever it is, but I think right now I'm going to talk with my boyfriend on the phone for a little bit and probably mess around on my computer. I think I might do some editing for this video and we'll catch up again later. Alright guys, so this is the end of my fall cozy productive nighttime routine. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope this video was somewhat entertaining for you. If you guys have any questions about anything or you just need someone to talk to, please leave me something down below in the comments because I respond to every single one. So I hope you all are staying safe, happy, and healthy. I love you so, so, so much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.